Netflix's latest binge-worthy series, Bridgerton, has taken the streaming world by storm. Based on a series of novels by Julia Quinn, the show features a beautiful Regency aesthetic, social commentary on issues like race, gender, and wealth, and an excellent ensemble cast to tie it all together. Of course, plenty of sexy shenanigans don't hurt its popularity either. Actress Phoebe Denevar plays eldest daughter Daphne Bridgerton and is apparently just as much of a fan of the series as we are. In an interview with Town & Country, Denevar said that while she loves a traditional period piece and grew up watching them, she believes that what makes Bridgerton so special are the unconventional ways in which the series breaks the mold. When she read the script for the series pilot, she said, she could instantly tell that it was unlike any period piece she had seen before. Less dodgy and stuffy, and more modern, steamy, and relevant. That spark of modern sensibilities is what made her so excited to be a part of the project. Watching Bridgerton, we've grown to become big fans of Denevar. And if you're anything like us, you've been obsessively wondering where you might have seen the breakout star before. Denevar has a pretty limited filmography at only 25 years old. She has starred in a few lesser-known series, her debut work coming as Siobhan Maley in the fifth season of the British TV series Waterloo Road in 2009. Over the next few years, she played a mix of recurring and guest roles in a variety of series. Some of her more notable roles came on shows like Prisoner's Wives, The Musketeers, and Monroe. A big moment in Phoebe Denevar's career occurred in 2017, when she made her debut on American television with Snatch, based on the Guy Ritchie film of the same name. Like the film, Snatch is a comedy drama following the lives of a group of hustlers navigating the world of organized crime. Denevar played Lottie Mott on the series and appeared alongside several other recognizable actors, including Rupert Grint, Luke Pasqualino, and Lucien Laviscount. Another recent role you may recognize Denevar from is her most recent work other than Bridgerton, a series called Younger by the producer of Sex and the City. While she wasn't the central star in this series, she did have a recurring role in which she played Claire, a bartender and Google employee. Your Grace, should we go upstairs? Denevar first auditioned for her Bridgerton role in February 2019. After her initial audition, it was months before she heard back from the Bridgerton casting directors to learn she had been cast. She told Harper's Bazaar that once she eventually heard from the producers that she'd gotten the part, things picked up very quickly. The beginning stages involved meeting her fellow cast members, trying on costumes, reading through the script, and going to countless rehearsals. She also had to go through essentially the actual preparations that her character would have to to learn the ropes of high society. Denevar took lessons in horseback riding, piano, dance, etiquette, and more to learn the ins and outs of how to convincingly portray Daphne. Denevar recalls that dance rehearsals were what helped her bond most with her fellow castmates, especially with Reggae Jean Page, who plays Simon Bassett, her hunky love interest. She explained that their six weeks of rigorous rehearsals were essential to prepping for the roles and developing chemistry with the cast as a whole. As for Bridgerton's numerous intimate scenes, Denevar says the rehearsals and blocking were unlike any romantic scenes she's been involved with before. She told BuzzFeed that they were given a dedicated intimacy coordinator, who helped them through filming these scenes and made them feel safe and comfortable. She also told Elle that the intimacy scenes were among the most mapped out and coordinated shoots on the series, and were rehearsed almost like stunt sequences. She said, I would literally know exactly where a guy was going to put his hand at what moment. And we'd have props, like mats, that went in between us. It was more intricately choreographed than our dance routines in a way, so I never really felt exposed at all. Check out one of our newest videos right here! Plus, even more list videos about your favorite stars are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.